Hi, I'm Matt from Leo's Vacation Center, and today we're going to take a look at the all-new floor plan by Passport, the 2900 RK. Stay tuned. Alright guys, how's it going? As I said, today we are looking at the 2018 Keystone Passport. This is a brand new floor plan called the 2900 RK. It is a great floor plan. I'm really excited for you to see it. First thing that catches my eye is those four windows right there. I haven't seen that in a travel trailer and then I, you know, I see it and I don't know what to expect. But when we go inside, you'll really love the results. Uh, this is a brand new floor plan, so please leave a comment uh, if you like it or if you don't like it because Keystone loves to hear feedback from it. Um, let's get started with the front. You know, this is a passport, aluminum frame with the fiberglass sides. You have a diamond plate rock guard right here. You have a manual power tongue jack. If you buy from me, I'm going to upgrade you to a power tongue jack for free just because I don't like these. Two 20 pound LP tanks, you can get 30 pounds, and then that's where your batteries would be. Now, this is new. I don't know anything about this yet, but when I do, I will have a video right over there. This says three year limited structural warranty from Keystone. Again, don't know what's going on there, um, but when I, when I know something, you'll be the first to know, and there'll be a video right there. Here, you have nice pass-through storage. You can see the aluminum frame held up by a magnet. Manual stabilizing jacks, which is great. Manual stabilizing jacks, they're covered under the Leo's lifetime warranty. And if you don't know what that is, there's a video right there for you to check out and see. You have a huge power awning kit with LED lights. That is what's great about this. Right here, extended season camping. So that means this has a heated and enclosed underbelly, good for, you know, late in the fall and early in the spring. Two axles spread out, easy tow system uh, that helps prevent sway while you're driving down the road. And then right here, you have a nice little outside the end of it coming around the back side here you do have a spare tire spare tire carrier this right here if the cable has um not the cable if the campground has cable you hook it up right there there's the exhaust for your furnace uh, big slide out right here 30 amp power this is where the cord is kept oh, almost forgot Right here, this is a grain dump tank. And then over here, this is where you hook up your black and your gray. So it looks like there's two gray dumping stations. One's for the kitchen in the rear, the other one's for the bathroom, and then only one black tank. Right here, this is your outside shower. This right here is your black tank flush. This is where you hook up your fresh water. This is where you hook up your city water. And here is the other side of that pass-through storage. All right, so the dry weight on this is 5,750 pounds. And looking inside, this is just a great floor plan. I know it's gonna be a very popular seller. You have a sofa here, tri-fold. It's the bigger one not the jackknife. If you've seen any of my videos, you know I don't like the jackknives. And I say it against our own products. So, I love when they give you a trifold because it's a good, comfortable bed, big enough for your guests that actually do come with you. And they're easy to set up. Then you do get 
two reclining chairs right here. I didn't even take the plastic off of them because they're so brand new. There we go. They're Euro chairs. They do not recline. I do know this one. Directly acro across from your sofa, you have a nice big U-shaped dinette. It does drop down and make a bed. Also, your TV's up here. So when you're sitting watching TV right there, you're looking head on at the TV. It is Furion and right here, you do have a Furion DVD, CD player all in one. Look at this kitchen. This has a ton of kitchen counter space. Big double sink, the four windows there, two windows there, kind of skylight here, gives it plenty of natural light. You have an oven, microwave, plenty of storage, plenty of storage. This doesn't have a door. Uh, I had some customers ask me about this at the RV show. I think it's just open because better to leave it open so you can use that storage than to just close it off. But you can close it off with that material. You have a nice big fridge. Two-way fridge runs off of propane and electric. And then some deep, deep storage there. Here's the bathroom. Pass-through bathroom with a good size shower. Corner shower. And then you can get through it from the bedroom or from the living area. Finally, we're in the bedroom area. You have great amount of storage, queen size bed. You can walk through on both sides. You have a little side space there, individual lights. Also, two windows across from each other, good for some cross ventilations. Also, the AC is ducted in here. And you have another light there. A great bedroom. It's a great size for such a small lightweight camper. Great, thanks so much for watching my video on the all new 2900 Passport. If this is one of your first time watching one of my videos, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also, if you need more information about this unit or pricing, you can send me an email. It is matt at leosrv.com. Or if you wanna come down to the dealership and see one of these in person, not a problem. Give me a call or send me a text. It is 301-906-0962. Thanks so much for watching.